All right, folks, welcome back to Glasgow News. Right, okay, <clears throat> I'm on the Daily Record. The link up there in blue will be in the description as usual. This is a story by Fraser Wilson. It's about a couple of wee chavs, a couple of Neds, Fisco Bride, who attacked a guy and his girlfriend in a car park, the Olympia Car Park Shopping shopping Centre Car Park, um, in March, I believe. Uh, brutal Lee Scobride car park thug kicked the victim so hard he left a footprint on his face. Paul Quinn, that's Paul Quinn there, let me nick him. Typical chav looking nevin, isn't he? And Ben Bryden, let's have a look at him. There he's there, look, look. that's his serious face. Right, your Instagram face, Ben. <laughs> right, okay, so. A new dad assaulted in an East Bay car park attack was kicked so hard he was left with a shoe imprint in his face. The victim, who does not wish to be named, told the East Bay News how he was jumped by Paul Quinn and Ben Bryan took two of them, eh? Ridiculous. Appearing at Hamilton Sheriff Court this week, the pair admitted their guilt and are now awaiting sentence. Well, we'll just wait and see how they got on, because they should be uh, put away for a wee bit. Uh, because apparently, uh, not only did they... Well, well, I'll read it on like you hear it. Quinn, a prisoner from Bryden. Quinn? A prisoner and Bryden of Applegate Drive admitted assaulting the man at the Olympia Shopping Centre. The court heard how, well Quinn is the one that will get get the time because you'll find it in a minute. The court heard how Quinn, 18, stamped on his victim whilst he was on the ground. He also admitted brandishing a knife, there you go, and threatening witnesses who went, went to help the victim. Uh, fiscal Deputy Lisa Lan told the court Lisa Lan, that sounds like something for a Superman movie, isn't it? Lisa Lan. <laughs> or a Batman film or something. Holy Toledo. Told the court how the victim and his girlfriend were in the car park at 11.30pm when the two accused ran towards them. She told the court, Bryden immediately pushed the complainant against a pillar and both accused then played a part as he was thrown to the ground and they set about him. Uh, the victim's girlfriend was screaming and this attracted the attention of other people who came to assist. Quinn appeared to walk away but was seen to turn back, stamp on the victim's face and then try to stamp on it again. He approached the witnesses who were checking that the complainer was okay and pulled out a knife with a blade of five to six inches. Brandishing this, he said, I'll take you on, I'll take you all on. Do you want to fight? Quinn was jabbing the knife in a stabbing motion before walking away. So basically it all started because the assault victim, the assault victim sustained cuts and bruising and told the East Cabrera News, I was on the phone and they were walking past when Bryden said something shady. I should have ignored it, but I got annoyed and answered back. A wee bit later they saw us outside Sainsbury's and Bryden came towards me. And that's how it all kicked off. And the boy says this, I'm fine to be honest, there, are, there was no real lasting physical or emotional damage. You don't get compo when you say things like that, mate. Right? You know? You should have kept your mouth shut and said you were emotionally damaged. But you technically are emotionally damaged because you're going to say, I'm just a wee bit more weary when out, especially when I'm in East Kilbride. So, you know, psychologically it's affected you. So, you need compo for that. You know? That's going to be a grand. <laughs> Sentence was deferred at court until later this month. A sheriff, David Bickett, called for background reports. They'll not be very good. Quinn was remanded in custody while Bryden had his bail continued. So that's Bryden there. He just assisted Mr. Quinn. There he's there, look at that wee face there. Oh, I'll do every one of you. <laughs> Can you fight sleep? Without a knife anyway, or a pal. Right, okay folks, uh, that's 4 minutes and 17 seconds. If you like the content, and I'll update you on this one, hit the like button, share and subscribe. Peace out.